<laughs> Honey, I brung something from town for you. Thank you, Sam. Oh, I, I got a letter for you, Martha. Thank you, Sam. You're more than welcome. You know, I never had time to learn how to read. But it's from your son, Josh. The war is over, and I just got my discharge papers from the 10th Cavalry. Thank God the killing is over. I'm looking forward to seeing you and eating that good old home cooking of yours. I got me some good farming land, and we can come back here and make a home for ourselves. By the time this letter reaches you, I should be about a half day's ride from you. Your son, Josh. Josh is coming! <laughs> Y'all, yeah, come on in. I'm going to fix you the best meal you ever ate. I'll be right there. Down to supper. Come on in. Never got dressed down. Talk about the beef pretty good. Concentrate on your food, Weasel. I'd better concentrate on her. Here's some nice hot biscuits for you. Those are my specialty. Here's some nice hot Rattlesnake goose. Coming over, Weasel. Mighty fine meal. Mighty fine. Man rides a long way. He needs something solid to stick to his ribs. The man needs more food, though. I'd sure like to have a big help to you. Who wouldn't? Ha, <laughs> ha, yeah. Does someone care for some more stew? Oh. No, I... That sure is a pretty wife you got there. She's my new bride from back east. I'm a mighty lucky man. They sent me a picture to one of those mail-order bride places back east. Paid for her to come out here and be my wife. You mean you done bought her? I sure am a mighty proud man. Just like all. I hope I never give you any cause to be sorry or disappointed. Oh, Sam. <laughs> I said that's enough! Let me buy a little skit from you, too. I said that's enough! Oh, you're
Howdy. Your name's Sam? What do you want, boy? Looking for a black woman named Martha. You Josh? Yes, sir, I'm Josh. I'm sorry, boy. Some men rode by yesterday, took my wife, killed Martha. Where's the buried? Looks like we lost him in the rock, Sam. We trailed him as far as we could. Who's that? Martha's boy, Josh. you got. It belonged to my pa. It was all Martha owned. Where about did you lose them, Sheriff? About 10 miles east in the hills. But there's five of them. I just finished fighting me a war, Sheriff, and I killed nearly twice that many.
here. Start the campfire. I'm going to try this effort out. Who's that? Yeah. When did my turn come? Don't wear it out. Go over the jet. Make her remember you. Old Jed sure been back there a long time. <laughs> sure has. <laughs> she sure must be something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what old Jed's doing back there anyway? <laughs>
Somebody tracking us. Maybe it's a lawman. It's a black man. There ain't no black lawman. Pete? You boys go ahead. I'll finish him off and catch up later. Don't be long, Pete. Let's go.
Sweet thing, a little favor by taking it away from that old man. <laughs> Let's get some shut eye.
What's that flat powder wall? Well, well, what are we going to do now, Dad? Let's just keep moving. I know a town he'd be plumb loco to try to follow us into. Let's go. Howdy. Howdy. Looking for three men and a woman who might have rode this way. Don't recall seeing them. You're welcome to stop and rest a while. You look tired. Thank you. This stranger here is looking for three men and a woman who rode this way. I asked him to stop and rest his back. Good. Howdy, I'm Rod. Josh, these folks are friends of yours, Josh? Nope. Been on the trail long? Well, a couple of days. Must get lonely riding out there all alone. Got my horse. I can tell by the way you got your back to your leg. You're a gunslinger, right? Maybe you're a bounty hunter. Maybe you're an outlaw. Thank you for the coffee, ma'am. I better be moving on. Gotta stay and taste my cooking on the best of the world. Thank you, ma'am. But I better be moving on. Right, so you can catch up to those folks and gun them down. Maybe there's a sheriff behind tracking you. Why don't you stay a spell longer, friend? Toss it over here. You ever killed a man before? You know what it feels like to kill? I killed in the war. People I didn't even know. Only the battleground is different now. You want to kill me? Go ahead.
<laughs> you know something, Jed? He was right about that black rider. He ain't gonna come to this town looking for us. <laughs> that black rider making me more crazy than ever was. <laughs> <laughs> And I'll use it too if and you make a move. My friendly ain't you? Who are you, mister? Oh, I just wait and tell your friends. We got company. He ain't my friend. They're part of a bunch of renegades around the town. Lost hombre, what you looking for around these parts? Looking for three men and a woman who rode this way a short time ago. You a bounty hunter? You a lawman? Either one. A stranger ain't welcome around these parts. I'm beginning to get that feeling. If you don't mind, I'll move on. Yeah, well, the woman stays with us. That's fine with me. You can ride out the same way you came in. Now, that ain't the way I'm headed. Now, I can either ride around you or through you, either way. Well, you better look around before you start anything. All I have to do is raise my hand and you're a dead man. You do. You're the last time you raise it.
We're boxed in. I guess so. My place is just a few miles away. I round up the horses for you. What about you? Where do you go? My fighting ain't over yet, lady. sleep tonight with me. No, she can't. She's my woman now. Well, how come I can't sleep with her? <laughs> you just do like I tell you. You go out there and stay in that shit by yourself. I ain't going out there that dark cap all by myself. Yet I'm staying here with you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
A double. Rye or whiskey? Whiskey will do just fine. I'm looking for three men and a woman. You seen them ride through here? Who wants to know? No, we didn't see any. I followed the tracks here. You sure you ain't seen them? You call my friend a liar? You aching for trouble, Sonny. But I ain't aiming to start now. You got a big mouth, stranger. And I'm aiming to shut it. You never make it. looking for you. Was he black? Yep, he sure was. <laughs> what do you want? We figure it's worth something to you to see that he don't bother you no more. Jack, Jack, pay, pay for Christ's sake, pay! You will leave my mind! What's your price? We figure maybe a hundred apiece. Well, you bring him to me. Dead. You get your man.
este ya de esto ya no se levanta. Let's take him to the abandoned shack. You find that in me? Well, glad to see you awake, mister. My name's Joshua. Mine is Maria. Well, Joshua, looks like the worst of your troubles ain't over yet. You got a very high fever. And I reckon pretty soon you're gonna be a sick fella. Looks like every time we meet, somebody's always getting shot. Yeah, except in this time it's you. You must want these fellas pretty bad to follow them into this territory. You have no choice. You're a bounty hunter? No, ma'am. I'm gonna kill him. That's all men think of. Killing. Sometimes. Man has to kill in order to have peace. of your fever is over. I talked a lot during your fever last night. Talked about three men and a woman riding into town. So I sent one of my men to check on it. And they're still there. Uh -uh, uh -uh. Hold it, hold it now. Easy now. You're gonna need more time than that. Maybe after a good meal you'll be stronger. stayed on after my husband was killed. That lady with these fellas, she a woman? Nope. You really have to do it, don't you? Josh, after you fight, it's over.
Rider's still on our trail. Weasel, bring up some fresh water. Oh, 
Weasel! Where are you? Weasel!
Okay, all right, here we go. Come on. <laughs> My mother's son. 